long story short, he's pretty dangerous if you don't know what you're doing. But yeah, after that, uh, Gideon runs off and we have to chase him. Okay, quick little pit stop later and we're in the techno base. So here we are, our final stage of the game. T about this wrench that I'm using, if you take it to fight Gideon and fight Gideon with this wrench, you will have no problem beating him. This wrench is broken as hell. I don't, it, it doesn't pierce enemy defense, but it does um, have a really high hit ratio. See, I was able to hit that thing without it blocking. But I'm going to stop using it because it's really too cheap and I don't want to keep using it. Uh, but anyway, you can see that there we are now in a techno base with these um, robots that the Katayanagis in invented and this robot. Be careful not to stand next to him when he dies because he explodes. He will damage you. Da, 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 da. Punch the robot. Kick the robot. Oh, tries to punch me. Failure. Dun, 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 dun. We have some new enemies here. These guys will are projectile users, meaning they will only shoot you and will do nothing else out of the ordinary. Oh, they fly too. Da, 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 da. Yeah. Oh, more robots. Kill the robots. I'm Scott Pilgrim, therefore I own. Boom, 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 bam, 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 bam. Yeah, exactly. Hey, ah, kapow. Watch out. Boom, boom. Aww. Kapow. There we go. Whoop. Lasers. Only do one damage. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles reference with these uh, little muncher, chomper thingies. They only have two HP and they are easy to defeat. Uh, oh, come on. No, 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 I don't. Uh, hey, stop it. Seriously. Okay. Uh, air jump, air kick. Uh, hey, hey, stop. There we go, finally. And sentries. You mean you? What? What the hell just happened? Okay. So, okay. S seriously, stop. Okay, thanks. <gasps> yeah. Yeah. Oh. Okay. You die today. No, you die now. Now you. you there we go. Hey, hey. Boom, boom. Elbow. J Damn it. Okay, stop getting up! Running on conveyor belt, yee, more robots. You, come on, hit him! Uh. Boob punch to the face. Reminder, I'm calling it the boob punch even though it's not even, that's probably not even the name of the attack. I'm just calling it that because Scott used it against Roxy. Oh boy. Da -da 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 -da. Just roll across the conveyor belt because I'm badass. Hey, knives! Get out here! Stun him! Attack! Kapow, there we go. Run! Hey! Two lasers on either side of the battlefield. This battlefield is. Okay. Oh my god. Reavers? Okay. Okie dokie. I was gonna go into something there, but I guess I was too late for that. So. Attacking a robot. That's what I do. Now run. Yep! I shouldn't have done that. Whatever. Hey, don't attack me. I'm on to you. I'm on to you. I know. Hey! I know your little tricks, little robot. There we go. Do, do, do. These enemies right here, the Albertas, these things are annoying as hell. At least, they are the um, probably the most difficult enemy you'll be fighting um, as a standard enemy that's like the early enemies, not like a robot. Plus these these uh, <coughs> yeah. these things also give you uh, money. So yeah, there you go. There's some money. Uh, these things are really annoying, but they do drop uh, they do drop their little I don't even know what they are like antenna swords, and you can use them against them. So pretty uh, difficult. These guys just keep jump kicking. One's down, the other one's down. Okay, thanks. Goodbye. These guys also drop money. The those are the only two enemies in this area that drop money. And into the shop, and let's buy an energy tank, which gives us 100 HP. I wonder if that sounds familiar to anybody. It doesn't revive any guts power, so... That must mean it's a Kirby reference. No, it's a uh, Mega Man reference. Da -da -da -da. Da -da. Hey, hey, hey. No one blocks the boob punch. Yeah, be yeah. You know, I I I'll deal with you later. Wait. Let me see if I can actually... 
Did I get her? Ha! <laughs> okay. And coming up here, we have a uh, gauntlet, so to speak. You have these guys firing at you. Take care of them as quickly as possible. And yeah. Hey, no. You stop it. Okay. Hey, stop. No! Okay. Seriously. Seriously, stop. Okay. No. No. Stop grabbing me! As much as I like girls grabbing me, it's not fun to have them grab me while I get attacked by other crazy thing, cyborg majiggers. Beat up the robot. Yeah, I'm badass. Run! Okay, let's collect the money and go to the final battle. There's Gideon. Gideon Graves, age unknown. Is this the real Gideon? Powers unknown. Anyway, here we have the final boss with the Gideon Graves. He has a lot of HP and he attacks really fast, so be wary. Be aware of him. He is very difficult. Uh, you really do kind of need a lot of patience for this fight. Um, if you're not very, if you're not a very patient person, then you're kind of, you know, screwed. But da -da -da -da. Uh, the best option for you in this fight is to dodge roll continuously, because uh, when he attacks, he stays facing the same way. So if you dodge roll behind him and then start punching him, then uh, it's a pretty, pretty easy fight. Uh, also, a little trivia here. I don't know if anybody else has noticed this. I'm pretty sure if someone has, but notice that the uh, lighter circle that I'm standing, that I was just standing in, in the center of the battlefield. Just note that and wait until the end of the fight. Knives, get out of here! Stun him! Wah! There we go. Beat him up! Beat him! Hey! No beating me up! No! No! Okay. I yeah, revive. Now beat up the nerd! Hey, hey! No attacking me while you're down. You're not supposed to do that. Die. Seriously. I really have nothing to say here. This is a very tough battle. Not very tough if you know what to do and if you can spare your... Like, if you can keep your lives and health pretty much... There we go, we got him down to glowy head. Stop attacking me like that. That's cheap. That's that's asshole-ish. You, you stop! Okay, that's it. That's it, bro. Stop. No. You. Okay. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, beat him up. Okay. Now, over here. Now, j now stop. Yeah, critical. Okay. Now, now, now. Over there. Jump. Yeah. Uppercut it. And now, punch. But No! Yeah, there we go. Boob punch to the nerd. Now, ha! No! Ah! Uh, trying to hit him, trying to hit him, get him, get him, get him. No! Well, that was weird. Keep attacking! He's really getting down to. Whoa, there was a counter. Um, he's getting down to some low HP. I'm trying. I'm gonna try to finish him off with a with one of the uh, patented boob punches. Hey, we got a compa- wait, he's still standing. Okay, we can do this, we can do this, come on. Oh, stop, no. I'm trying to hit you, trying to hit you, get, get up. Stop! Okay, hit him, no! Get it, get it, over there. Yes, no, yeah, no! Stop hitting me! Come on, come on, come on, yeah! Aw, the animation ended. Anyway, here's what I meant by the, uh, circle in the middle of the battlefield. <gasps> what the f- the Gideon was a robot? Oh my god, super awesome plot- Wait a minute, wait a minute! Uh, I see what you did there, you sneaky bastard. You know what? You pulled a Dr. Wily on me. You know how you're going to perish? You know how I'm going to break you? Well, I'm going to do another reference. But for now, it's, it's a... I totally just ruined that. Well, whatever. So, that was the final boss of Scott Pilgrim vs. The World, the game. Not This is not the end of the video, though, and there's one more part to this uh, series of my of the Let's Play. Uh, second to last, actually. The last part will be credits. And yes, the credits are indeed 13 minutes long. It is insane. It is crazy. It's retarded. Okay.
Now that we got that established, there is the uh, Chaos Theater. And underpants that are supposed to be a white flag of sorts. But Scott is victorious. Yeah. And so... Scott was saddened by Ramona's departure, but only for a little while. Soon he was dating Knives, Kim, and Envy all at once. He was the happiest guy in the world. Or was he? Well, hopefully you enjoyed this Let's Play of Scott Pilgrim vs. The World, The Game. Uh, this is Woody Geek, and I'll see you guys later. Hopefully you enjoy the credits as well, so see you guys later.